Hi, I'm Robert Osborne. Thanks so much for being here for the start of our Salute to the Dynamic Burt Lancaster is our Star of the Month for November. We're going to be honoring Burt every Wednesday in prime time. That means a lot of great movies ahead. We're going to start where Burt started, with his very first film, the one that made him a star overnight. And there's no question why when you see this movie. The movie is The Killers, released in 1946 by Universal, when that company was known as Universal International. It's based on a short story written in the 1920s by Ernest Hemingway. And interestingly, in a way, it resembles Citizen Kane. It introduces Burt to films as Citizen Kane introduced Orson Welles as an actor. And the structure of the film, The Killers, is very close to the structure of Kane. It starts with a man's death, then follows an investigator as he tries to understand the mysterious events leading up to that death. From then on, though, The Killers marches to its own drum, especially when it turns out that the man's death revolves around a gorgeous singer played by Ava Gardner in what was a star-making role for Ava as well. Before making this next film, Ava had been toiling away mostly in secondary parts at the MGM Studios, where she was under contract. Well, the producer of this movie, Mark Hellinger, was convinced Ava had far more potential than MGM ever allowed her to show. So he went to MGM, managed to borrow her for this movie, and it paid off like gangbusters for Ava, just as it did for Burt. Ava was a veteran of 25 movie appearances at this point, Bert zero, but both their lives were changed forever after. One critic described Bert Lancaster in this movie as the brawny Apollo. Now they called him a brute with the eyes of an angel, and he remained a major star and force in films, also as a producer and director, the rest of his life. The cast in our movie also includes Edmund O'Brien, Albert Decker, and Sam Levine, and earned Oscar nominations for its director, Robert C. Odmack, for its writer, Anthony Beeler, editor, Arthur Hilton, and music composer, Miklos Rosa. Talented people. From 1946, here's our star of the month for November, Burt Lancaster, in his very first film, The Killers.